Osteoarthritis to me is a growing into process. And I don't know that it's with aging, but it seems more apparent to be with aging than not. Old age is in your mind. I might not be able to do the things I did when I was young, but I still think of myself as being young. With OA, I feel like it's a part of um, me getting older. So I'm just saying, well, you know what, buddy? You've got it, and we're just gonna deal with it. Well, you know, when I was young, I was an athlete. I used to run all the time. I used to walk all the time. As I got older, it began to slow down. The day is pretty well planned, unless there are extracurricular activities like appointments. But I get up with Luke because we worry that maybe he needs to go out, and whether he needs to or not, we think he does, so I take him for a mile walk. And for the rest of the day, Luke goes out with Lenny. Well, Luke is, Luke's my buddy. Um, and when Diane's uh, off uh, working, uh, uh, he stays with me and he depends on me for, for everything. When we talked about getting a dog, we knew that as we grew older and with some degree of arthritis, that we would stay mobile because he depends on us. Lenny and I go to all the home football games, all the home basketball games, and we try to go to the ACC tournament games. So we just stay moving. When I go to the Dean Dome, I am there and people are looking at me. So I am walking as straight as I can and as fast as I can. I'd rather be seen as basically a former athlete who is still in good shape and uh, walking and having fun. The biggest thing for me is going to the UNC Wellness Center because it's an accepting place. I like walking in the Walk with a Doc program because I feel like walking in a group and having conversations just makes the time just vanish. You've done that mile before you know you've, you've ever done it. And I think it's a good way to be able to ask questions of the doctors that are that are there and you're in an informal setting and you don't feel like you're going because you're sick, you're going because you're healthy. I'm a big advocate for any kind of movement, any kind of walking, and yes, it hurts. But it's almost like setting up a goal and saying, you know what, nobody can meet it but me. My main motivation to stay active is that I'd like to have a life that's as qualifying as it is quantifying. I don't want to be somebody that doesn't have a purpose. Don't let it bring you down. Just, just you know, work through it if you can. If it's a pain pill, it's a pain pill. If it's an injection, it's an injection. But don't let it stop you from doing what you want to do, if it's possible. I think people with arthritis, if you embrace rather than reject what's happening to you, then the embracing part is saying, this is who I am, and I've sort of earned this. You know, it's okay. Just refuse not to, not to let it get you down, and, and just try to, to lead a, as normal life as possible with limitations, so you walk a little bit slower, so it takes you a little bit harder to get dressed, but, but don't let it, just don't let it get you down.